Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Houston Sports Talk back in the video today. And the New York Jets have signed wide receiver McCole Hardman from the Kansas City Chiefs. What a surprising and really good move for the New York Jets today. I mean, uh, talk about the weapons that Aaron Rodgers will have next season with the Jets. Once that trade is done, he will have McCole Hardman now. They signed Alan Lazard. Not to mention they still have Garrett Wilson, who was the best rookie of last season. And that was with so many bad quarterbacks throwing him the ball. Yeah, Zach Wilson throwing him the ball. Uh, I'm not going to say Mike White was bad, but not as good as um, Aaron Rodgers will be throwing him the ball this season. So Garrett Wilson with Aaron Rodgers as his quarterback next season should evolve. Uh, with with um, with Aaron coming in, so you got those wide receivers out, and then you have Corey Davis as well. Not to forget, you have Corey Davis, who a guy who's, um, you know, yeah, Corey Davis, a guy who, um, he's a good wide receiver. It's just there is a chance he could be cut because of his contract, but it'll be interesting to see if he stays on the roster. You got those four guys, and also if you want to make Aaron Rodgers happy, you probably have to bring in Randall Cobb as well. So you got five potential five wide receivers there. Uh, for Aaron to throw the ball to. That's just a stack wide receiver core for Aaron Rodgers next season. And then they, with this signing, they do trade Elijah Moore, who I just did a video about uh, with that trade as they trade uh, the 74th pick in the third, that's in the third round and, and uh, Elijah Moore to the Cleveland Browns for pick 42. That's in the second round, uh, which is was a, I think was a good trade for both sides. Um, and I talked about that. If you want to hear me talk about that, go watch that video. But yeah, this is a good signing for the Jets. I mean, he's a guy who had three three hundred receiving yards last season, four receiving touchdowns, twenty five receptions. That's only in eight games, by the way, because he had some injury problems. Had thirty rushing yards and two rushing touchdowns, so six touchdowns in the total year with three hundred thirty total uh, with three hundred thirty total yards. So three hundred thirty total yards and six total touchdowns in um, a total of eight games. So. I mean, if you 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 got him all season healthy all year, you got a great guy. And he's also a special. He's also a kick returner too, and he's a great kick re- kick and punt returner. So that will be really big advantage for the Jets as well. By the way, they signed him to a one year six and a half million dollar deal. It's gonna be interesting to see how he does next season. Aaron Rodgers once his trade is official, Aaron has all the weapons next season. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts on the signing for the Jets and peace out. I'm your thoughts.